Just a few more minutes to meet up with meteorologist Dan Henry and donate a toy for a child. But if you miss Garland's toy drop off tonight, we do have several more set up throughout the week. Let's check in with Dan, see how the night's gone so far. Dan? Steve, fantastic. Quite an outpouring here in Garland tonight. We literally just got the, the final tally here. 1,902 toys collected in uh, roughly 57 boxes and, oh, by the way, 22 bicycles and some uh, larger items that couldn't fit in the boxes. So it's been a tremendous response out here. And uh, as you said, things are going to continue tomorrow night in Fort Worth. Of course, this would not all be possible without the uh, volunteer help of a lot of people. And uh, let's let's go on down the line and introduce you to uh, two fine folks here from Two Men in a Truck. Hello, I'm Ross Garcia from Two Men in a Truck. Carolyn Chenoweth from Two Men in a Truck. And of course, the, uh, the, the face of uh, the actual Toys for Tots campaign, uh, the Marines who uh, volunteer their time as well. And let's go down and, and meet these folks. I'm Corporal Padilla from Chicago, Illinois. Max Bronson from Big D Detachment. All right. I'm Sergeant Shakespeare from Castle Rock, Colorado. Okay. Sergeant Adams from Dallas, Texas. Sergeant Ritchie from Emporia, Kansas. We appreciate uh, your service uh, and, and your volunteer time here. Of course, the, the fine folks at uh, Two Men in a Truck. Uh, so we've got over 1,900 toys, uh, ladies and gentlemen, to get loaded. So let's start getting loaded here. Load up the trucks. Uh, it's been a very successful night here. Uh, obviously, if you weren't able to come see us tonight, you've got four more, uh, at least four more opportunities this week. You can also go to our website, fox4news.com, or the Fox 4 uh, News uh, Facebook page, and there's a link on there where you can make an online donation. But, uh, Steve, we've set the bar very high for us. Uh, the rest of the week here. It's been a great night, quite an outpouring here in Garland. Nicely done, Dan. Way to go. All right, folks, you've got about 10 minutes to get Thank you. Merry Christmas. The holiday season continues with another Toys for Tots drop-off spot at Firewheel Town Center in Garland. Fox 4 Chief Meteorologist Dan Henry has been out there since this afternoon, and I'm sure you've seen the, the amount of toys, Dan, just grow and grow. I, Heather, it's it's been amazing here. A lot of big hearts have shown up from Garland, from Rowlett, from Wiley and surrounding areas. I'll have a final tally for you coming up at uh, 10 o'clock. I do want to give a big shout out to uh, Watson uh, MST, the school in Garland there. They showed up with at least 50 students and their parents with $1,700 worth of toys. Every dime of that money was earned by those kids doing odd jobs, doing chores, doing lots of different things. Uh, they purchased the, the toys last week and then they hand delivered them uh, tonight. So our thanks to them. A lot of good folks helping out. We also just had a donation here, our most recent donation. This is Team Heavy Flex. They specialize in a car audio here. They had the parking lot shaking just a few minutes ago. But uh, gentlemen, thank you so much for your donation. Your names, please. Uh, my name is Joe. My name's Vito. And uh, what brought you out here tonight? Um, just wanted to give back. Uh, we put so much money into our cars. Uh, just really wanted to give back and help the community, help the kids. How does this make you feel? Make us feel great. Kids deserve a nice Christmas. And you uh, made that happen. Thank you both, gentlemen, for uh, for stopping out here. You still have time. We're still going to be out here for, oh, for roughly about 45 minutes. Uh, we're located right off Garland Road here. That's at least the closest entrance for Firewheel. Very convenient. There's Toys R Us right there. If you've got some last uh, minute shopping to do here, uh, stop in there, get a couple extra toys, and we'll be happy to take them off your hands here. Got another a hit coming up at uh, 10 o'clock. I do want to pass on to you, if you can't come out here tonight, you can always go to our website or to the Fox 4 News Facebook page. We've got a link on there uh, where you can make an online uh, donation. But uh, I think you're going to be uh, very pleased with the numbers that we're going to share with you coming up at 10 o'clock. We have really set the bar high here in Garland for the rest of the week here and we've got great weather that's going to continue for our collection campaign for the rest of the week. Steve, Heather? All right, Dan, outstanding. Thank you. We'll see. Also ahead tonight at Toys for Tots Drive underway right now in Garland. Look at all of these amazing toys donated for people in North Texas by people here in North Texas. Fox 4 Chief Meteorologist Dan Henry is there in Garland. A look at the generosity coming up on Fox 4 News at 9.
All right, Chip, thank you. Okay, this is always such a great time of year when Fox 4 helps Marines collect toys for tots. Tonight, we are in Garland at the Fire Wheel Town Center. Chief Meteorologist Dan Henry. Dan, you know, I think you planned this. You picked a great weather night for you to be out. Oh, uh, we, we lucked out, Heather. I'll tell you what, the weather is fantastic, and, and it looks to stay that way for the rest of the week. As you said, we're here at Firewall, a Firewheel, excuse me, in Garland, very close to the entrance off Highway 70. Hey, we've already had our first big donation, courtesy of the uh, Kuntz family from Highland Park. Look at the 16 brand new bicycles that they brought about to 45 minutes ago, and uh, we are positioned out here right outside the Toys R Us. How convenient is that? If you've got shopping to do for your kids, your grandkids, pop in. We encourage you to get an extra toy. And we just had uh, a really nice donation courtesy of uh, these two beautiful little kids. Uh, this is uh, Camilla and that is Rhett. And this is a uh, proud mom, Jennifer. Jennifer, where do you live? We live here in Garland. And uh, you came out and you donated this toy. Can, can you donate that to, for Toys for Tots, Camilla? Oh, that's beautiful. Thank you so much. How old are your kids? Um, she's three and he's two. Three and two. They're, they're a little camera shy right now until the cookies came out and then they, 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 they beamed <laughs> right up. But this is what we're after. We're after uh, new unwrapped toys. Uh, in particular, we're looking for girls ages six to eight and nine to 12. There's a particular need for those uh, age groups here uh, for Toys for Tots, but we've got the Marines here. I'll introduce you to those uh, fine gentlemen here coming up. And of course, the uh, fine folks with the two men in a truck are out here assisting us as well. We'll be back uh, live at 540 with an update. Our goal, Heather, is to set the bar as high as possible uh, for the rest of the week here. And I think we're off to a great start. Sounds great. Have fun. We'll see you soon, Dan. Thank you. Now we're going to be at Firewheel. All right, it is great weather tonight. This is Firewheel Town Center in Garland. Please get involved in the fun tonight if you can. Help us collect toys for tots. Some room in those boxes there. Dan Henry's out there, and we're going to check in with him on how generous you've been so far. It's going to be a long night, though. You've got through 1030 tonight. Get out there if you can. We'll be checking in with Dan after the break. Then one foggy Christmas Eve, Santa came to say. All right, so the stock market didn't give much today, but you sure can. Fox 4 is helping the U.S. Marine Corps Reserve collect toys for tots. And we're making stops all across North Texas this week so you can help. Chief Meteorologist Dan Henry is in Garland at Firewheel Town Center. It's a great location with great weather, Dan. Good selection. Nice pick of a location you're going to be at tonight. I, I can't uh, take credit for it, but uh, boy, uh, you're right. We are off to a fast start here. We've already filled up several boxes uh, full with toys. And of course, that's what we're after here. New unwrapped toys. If you're looking for ideas, you can't go wrong with Star Wars. Star Wars is a very hot item this year. Also something called Zoomer Zuppies, uh, which was uh, an idea given to me by the folks uh, in Toys R Us. Want to introduce you to some very special folks, the hardworking Marines who are out here with us year in and year out. Some years much colder than others. I think we're lucking out tonight, but let me introduce you uh, to, uh, to all these gentlemen here. I'm Sergeant Shakeshaft from Castle Rock, Colorado. Thank you for being here. Sergeant Adams from Dallas, Texas. Thank you, sir. Sergeant Ritchie from Emporia, Kansas. Uh, Corporal Padilla from Chicago, Illinois. Corporal Hall from Richmond, Virginia. Thank you, gentlemen, for being out here. They've already uh, unloaded several vehicles uh, full with toys here. We are in a great location. We're just off Highway 78 here uh, at the Firewheel Town Center, conveniently located right outside of Toys R Us. So if you've got some shopping to do, uh, you can pop in, grab a couple of toys. If you can't be here tonight, if you can't make it out, go to our Facebook page or our fox4news.com uh, website. We've got links on there where you can give a cash donation. We've also got links on there with the location of where we are at. We're going to be here tonight uh, until after 10 o'clock through our 10 o'clock newscast. Hope to see you out here. Our goal is to collect as many toys as possible tonight and get the uh, week started on a great note. And I think we're already off to a very fast start here, Steve. Okay. And that Toys R Us right behind you is so convenient. All right, Dan Henry, nice job. Thank you. <laughs> Emerald City sax player helping with the holiday spirit. At Hockaday School in North Dallas today, girls from the second and third grade, Brownie Troops 
along with seniors from the Community Service Club, collected toys for tots during morning carpool today. <laughs> Students from the all-girls school were all smiles. They sang songs, they collected toys, and learned about giving back. Um, it's really important because I, I think it makes a lot of people feel good. <laughs> Well, we hope to see you and your family at tonight's Toys for Tot Drive, how you can brighten up a child's holiday coming up. Plus, Mike. Christmas toy. Fox Force Dan Henry is at Firewheel Town Center with, by the way, a Toys R Us conveniently close, and he's collecting toys for tots. Hi, Dan. Hello there, Steve. Uh, we're right off of the uh, Highway 78 entrance here at Firewheel Town uh, Center. And, and look what's conveniently behind us here, too. Toys R Us. So if you need to do some uh, some buying for your kids, for your grandkids, you can pop in the store there and come out with a couple of extra gifts. And we've got plenty of Marines out here, plenty of helpers to help uh, assist you with getting them in the boxes. Speaking of which, we've already filled up about 30 boxes, but we, we're not done yet. Uh, we want to fill up many more. We've got two trucks here, two huge trucks, courtesy of two men in a truck. So we've got lots of room for toys. And speaking of donating toys, this is Zoe from uh, Rowlett. She's a second grader. She's a little camera shy. You are a pretty girl, though. And uh, her mom, Kim. And Kim, is this your uh, first time coming out here? Yes, it is. And uh, why was it important to bring uh, your daughter out here? Just wanted her to know that Christmas isn't about just receiving, but also giving. Thank you so much. Thanks for both of you for stopping out here. And again, we are looking for new unwrapped toys. If you need ideas, I've got them for you. I asked the folks in Toys R Us. They said anything Star Wars, uh, including um, lightsabers, of course, the, an easy bake oven. That is still a very popular item. Fisher Price, uh, smart toys, and something called Zoomer Zuppies. They're, uh, they're digital pets, but we're looking to fill up all these boxes here. We've already got plenty of bicycles, but we could use more. And if you don't want to buy a gift, we're also taking cash donations out here. You can also go on our website or the Fox 4 News Facebook page, and there are links there to direct you where we are and also so that you can donate online. Come on out here. We're going to be out here late till after 10 o'clock tonight. We hope to fill up two trucks here, Steve, and we're already off to a really, really good start. All right, Dan, Heather, what do you, I know you have some, you're the so, Toys for Tots experts. I know you love the kids and all that. I love this. Little We've Zoe coming out. We've been to Garland before, out. I believe. Yeah, we have. It's a great and it's location. Just, it's fantastic, Dan, and I know that you get this when you talk to the parents and the kids coming out, is just learning that true lesson, the, the real meaning of the season is giving and, and, and helping others in need. It's just, it's fantastic. It sure is, and the weather's cooperating as well. We we haven't had good fortune in years past with weather. Absolutely no problem, not only tonight, but it looks like for the rest of the week. And I love that, people passing toys behind you right now. See, it's so easy. Run into Toys R Us, grab a gift, bring them on out. Super easy.